Hello, I am Joe Alexy, and welcome back to Morrowind! We finally got our house better than it was. Okay, we still have a lot of garbage, uh, but pretty much stuff I don't want to part with. And My I'm not going to decorate the roof with these yet. I think since we spent so much time and it took me forever to actually get up here and do this, I literally wasted about three days of putting it off and then finished it in probably about maybe an hour or so. But that's fine. We're going to pick up and we're going to go back to um, Solstein. And I think we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to beat that dude's face in and continue with the quest line. So I did go ahead and I did Google to see how many quests we got left. And pretty much we have maybe eight quests and they're all about the same thing. Uh, Raven Rock. And there's... I think two, maybe three, quest of just miscellaneous stuff that we need to find the people on the island to do, which is fine. So pretty much, well, we are like almost completely done with Solstein, the uh, Blood Moon DLC. And once we're done with that, all the quests there, and you know, I feel comfortable leaving the area. Well, well, Sir, we will continue. Get out of my way! Hey, it's their brothers. Um, we will continue with Mournful. Oh my god, guys, come on. Yeah, he ain't even gonna bother with it. We're going this way. But once I feel like we have succeeded enough, that's all fine. We will continue with uh, Mournhold. And from Mournhold, we will complete the rest of the quest there. And once we're done there, we will be back one far to the where we will finish up the rest of the quests we have there. Alright. You want me to punch him in the face? Hello, Jalaxi. Are you here on assignment or did you just stop by? Assignment. Everything is on hold until Rather Strange is blocking the door. We need to get rid of it. Just be quick about it. I don't want to make this any more of a spectacle than our, it's already become. And don't kill him. Okay, so I'm going to save before. Because, you know, we're going to be putting our hands on this guy. We are pretty dangerous. Pretty, pretty dangerous. Alright, so now we need that, uh, what's that called? This does Helmet of Bear Kind. What's the Helmet of Bear Kind? So we can use the perk. Oh, you messed up today, Junior. Time to... You a lesson, old man. <coughs> I'll not give in to you. Cease this violence before you bring death and destruction on yourself. I will not give in to you. Cease this violence before you bring death and destruction on yourself. Okay, so I punched him in the mouth. He laughed at me. What do we do now? All right. All right, he gave us a warning. Apparently, we were hit hurting him. All right, my guy, you're gonna have to get. <coughs> Punch him in the crotch. Arf. Arf. Ow. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll go away. Just stop hitting me. Just give me a minute to collect myself. I promise I'll be gone the next time you come back. Oh, that's going to leave a bruise. <laughs> Alright, he's gone. Alright, that worked. Alright, we're here on an assignment, and we got rid of him. Good work, Jug. See, I appreciate you not being too harsh with him. Things can get back to one track now, and not a minute too soon. Take the news to Karnas, will you? And here, take this. It's not much, but I like to reward those that can follow orders. Thank you, my guy. Ooh. And we brought our, uh, get out of there things, so. Is it divine intervention takes us to the fort? I think so. All right, we're here. Okay, so, uh, going back to the quest. Is it her? No, it was her. 
Yeah. This girl gave us the quest to kill uh, the sugar I'd man. Be happy to talk. Somebody My else here has a quest real. about some dude losing his head. I don't know as to who it is, or actually, I don't even know where to go. I think he was up in this book. We're looking for Carnus Magnus, was his name. And I think he's upstairs. What up say you? One of these buildings. And I'm not as to sure which building he's in. Mm. Okay. So I kind of sat down and uh, went back and watched some of my old episodes of this. And we have come a long way. Oh my goodness. This is episode 126. 126 videos of Morrowind. I love it. All right, this looks like a place where we might find cards. What say you? Oh, yeah. I'd be happy to talk. My pleasure, really. Okay, maybe he's not. All is well here. I'm sure it is. All right. The uh, quest line that we are doing. Or that uh, we have left to do on Solstein. Like, Solstein, this entire area, all of our quests pertain to Raven Rock now. Uh, pretty much, we get the decision to make Raven Rock successful. I like what I see. Stuck here. Or we can, like, uh, stab him in the back and make it fail. What say you? Us holding a share of the place, we are going to try to make it successful. So we get paid more. Alright, I'm here on an assignment. So it's been dealt with. Shame that you didn't just kill him outright, but fair enough. As long as the work can continue, good job. There's no work for you right now, underling. Check again in a few days. Okay. All right. So he, I don't really like this guy. He's kind of like without me, it all falls to pieces. Exactly. He's he's a narcissistic pain in the ass. We don't like him. Hopefully, we can get revenge. What did I do to deserve this honor? Oh, nothing at all. I just happened to come by. Alright, so we're going to head back over to Raven Rock and see if that guy has another quest. And we're going to arm ourselves. We got $43,000. Boom! I love it. Love it, love it, love it. The prey approaches. I thought that we would have a lot more money, considering the first time we sold stuff was episode 50, and this was roughly 75 episodes after that. And I think we still made more money than we did last time, because we have 43000 in cash. And then we also got that, uh, a bunch of jewels, and we also got that 20000 uh, I think it was a Bone Lord, Soul Gem. That's fine. I have nothing for you. Uh, work continues to decline, but we must not do this. Okay, well, whatever. Alright, so we have no more work for these guys right now. I don't remember where that guy was at that was talking about losing his head. Actually, I think I'm going to go ahead and whip myself. I didn't bring my cell phone into the office. Oh, well. Oh, well. We'll just scout about. We've pretty much been everywhere. Let's look at our quest. Uh, cure for vampirism. This one's glitched out because we cheated to get through the wall and we found these two people and I thought we, it was like an Easter egg, but it wasn't. It's was actually a quest and we shouldn't have cheated because the rocks would disappear after we talked to the uh, Paul. I was told that the Twin Lamps are an anti-slavery organization. If I am asked, have you seen the twin lamps? I should say, they like the way to treat them. Hmm. House Redoran. Then Delnia Mandis mentioned that her father, Atherin Mandis, is probably worried about her. She gave me a locket to take to Athen Mandis as proof that she is safe. Okay, so that's the dude in milk. Okay, so I could have sworn we gave him that stuff. We might have to hit back up on that one. 
No, that's Tell Fry. This is the Mad Lord. Seemed to recover from his madness long enough to promise me he would no longer demand tribute from travelers if he knew if his daughter Dylan Lord was safe. He's apparently being held kept. Okay, so those, these two go together. And I'm pretty sure we can't uh, complete it because I do not have her necklace anymore. We don't give it to him. So we might have to go back and talk to him again. I recovered Admose's ring and returned it to her. Now I suppose she will use this divine intervention enchantment to escape. Show all. So active. Okay, these are active quests. Okay, okay. Okay, that's better. That's better. I was just looking at the list of quests. Okay. Okay, so these two are still in the work. These three are still in the work. That is for House... I don't know, House Redor and... Um, Mournhold. Ice Blade. Not seeing anything else. Lars Vara tells a little story. There's a rumor that the Legion champion Lars Vara over at Fort Moonmoth wants to talk to me about it. Unspecified subject. Okay, Fort Moon Moth. Fort Moon Moth. Uh, Garrison of Balamora. Alright. Alright, we're going to go find this kid. And we're going to see what he has for us. What was his name? Alright, options. Uh, his name is Laros Varro. Alright. We're going to Balamora. We're going to find Laris Guerrero, and we're going to see what he has to do. And I think that's how we're going to do this. We're going to go down the list and do quests as we get them. Uh, if you guys know of any quests that I'm missing or something interesting that I All I ask looked, for is a pair of boots. Post down in the comments. Let me know. We will get to it at our earliest convenience. I was initially wanting to 100% Morrowind, but the mages, or not mages guild, the fighters guild locked us out of the thieves guild. So we can't do their quest, and it's understandable the game's designed that way, so I'm really not going to hold it against the developers for Why walk it, when you can run. But it would have been nice to do the mother quest. Okay, that's right. Hey, we can do this! Yes, travel. Alright, Laros, Laros Vero, Lars Vero, or something like that. What did I do to deserve this honor? He didn't say what he wanted to talk. Ah, oh, here you are. I am Laris Vero, Legion Champion of Fort Moonwalt. I've been in, hoping you might come by. I've got some work for you if you're interested. Orders have you? Okay, he has no orders. Uh, what work do you have? The various channels, I've learned a bit about your situation. I'd like to tell you a little story, and when I'm done, you can ask me some questions, and then maybe you might decide to go out and do some things. You might, and you might not. That is, that's your affair, and I also want to tell you about a nice present, I think, the Emperor wants you to have. I'm not sure where it is, but maybe you'll want to check back and see if I found it later. After you've done some things. Story time. Once upon a time, there was a bad magistrate who took gold from the criminal organizations to reduce the sentences and fines of criminals. Everybody knew he was doing this, but nobody could prove it. Because even if it could be proved, the bad magistrate had important friends, and proof is not as powerful as important friends. Ah, you're absolutely right, my friend. At the same time, there was a gold officer, a good officer, who enforced the laws because he thought the laws made people happy and safe and had bothered the gold officer, good officer, why do I keep wanting to call him the gold officer, the good officer, that enforcing the laws did no good, because the bad magistrate let the criminals go as quick as the officer caught them. For a long time, the good officer sighed and said, what can I do? because the bad magistrate has important friends and nothing I can do will touch him. But then the good officer said, Say, wait a minute. 
what about the bad people who are bribing the bad magistrate? They haven't got important friends, and if they aren't around, then the bad magistrate can't get any more bribes. And even better, the good officer suspected that the bad people who were bribing the bad magistrate were probably criminals themselves, so the good officer decided that it would be good if the bad people who were bribing the bad magistrate just go away forever. So that good officer made a little special prayer that there would be a little bloodbath to wash the bad people away. There isn't that a nice little story, maybe not a perfect story because it ends with a prayer and not a bloodbath. Maybe the story isn't over yet. Oh, I like the way you think there, Varel. Tell me more about this bloodbath. The bad people in my story are five members of a Kemana Tong. I know they are a scout, a pawnbroker, a servant, a thief, a smith, and they are all in Bolomora. Unfortunately, I don't know their names, but maybe you can find their names and where to find them and then maybe my story could have a happy ending with a little bloodbath instead of a prayer. Okay, what about these bad people? The bad people of Kaman Tong. I thought everybody knew that. They are a criminal organization. Unfortunately, I don't know who the Kamana Tong are. No one will tell me because I am an officer and it is against the code of, to tell the officers things. But people in the Thieves Guild hate the Kaman Tong. I bet if you ask the Thieves Guild, they would cheerfully tell you who the bad people are and where to find them. But I warn you, these bad people are very tough. Tougher than you, I am afraid. Like them. Alright. Alright. How many did he say? Five? There are five of them. Alright. And they're all in Balamora. Can I get advancement? No. What about a job? You get a job for a... Oh, you don't. Okay. Ah, and then we could cheat again. Actually, I don't consider this cheating. I mean, we did find them. Fair and square. They're just really useful items. Alright, so we're gonna go hit up the Thieves Guild over at this bar. Ah, oh, yes, the Six House. I remember them. We were supposed to do something about them. We'll not remember. <laughs> we'll get to it later. So I don't know of any secretive people here. There you go. Uh, what can you tell me about bad people? If the bad people you're looking for are the Kaman Tong, Kaman Tong, about, and they're in Balamora, you'll find them in the Council Club Corner Club. That's the local Kamana Tong hangout. The scout would be Vadusa Serethian. Marissa Aaron would be the pawnbroker. The thief would be Madril Thurith. Sovro Trotto will be the savant. Thalian Valus would be the smith. Alright, so we need to find Council Club Corner Club. Uh, that's a south wall. All right, so I think they might be up on the hill, mainly because we don't ever have to go up there for anything. So I'm gonna look Say there you first. Want. You know, because if they are a band of low lives, they're probably hanging out in a pretty nice establishment. Okay, this is Lalu Council Manor. Man. That's not what I'm looking for. Tyrabble Manor. Tyrabble, that was a name, wasn't it? Tyrabble? Trandrail. I'm probably sorry, we just about broke into that house and killed an innocent person. What in here? There ain't no. Like, are they all gonna be in the same spot or are we gonna have to The Morong Tong. Hey! We work for these guys! You guys got work? Ah, yes. I'm looking for work. Writs or orders. Okay. 
she does not seem like the leader of the place. So I, uh, I am never too busy for a good talk. Well, I got plenty to talk about, my friend. What? All right. Oh my goodness, we got like a ten foot vertical. What do you want of me? So beautiful. All right, you look like a boss. Ah, oh, yes, master. Are you here to see what writs are open? I am. I have no writs for you at this time. Okay, she has no writs for us. But we will get miss miss my god, missions from her. All right, let's get out of here. This is our place and there. I'm a busy guy, so if you could hurry this up. Uh, I thought you were somebody I had a mercenary. I'm clear there, an alchemist. Oh, I bet you it's this place. They were all jerks to us in here. Eight plates. No. They said it was a council club. What? A bookseller. Yes, this looks like a place. No. Alright. Oh, it's probably the place with the party on the roof. Oh, what is this? Lucky lockup. Yes. We found it. No time for you, Bosma. Alright, so I'm pretty sure this is a guy. Uh, Thalen something or other. Uh, Thalen Velas. Ah, uh -huh, yes, we're gonna kill you. And, uh, Savor Trandro. Ah, uh -huh, yes, we're gonna kill you. And Nor Saren. I don't think his name was in the list. There's someone watching me. I can tell. But do so. I Rafferian. have no time for you, Bosma. Hey, but this is for us then. All right, and are you Marissa? Oh, you are. You are. All right, Marissa Ern. Okay. So one, two, three, four. Oh my God! I think they're all gonna be in this one building. Oh, this is gonna be a bloodbath. Filthy sweat. Oh, you said the wrong thing, lady. Mandrill Trillith. Or something like that. Oh, we found her. All right. All right. I'm going to save here. We're going to do the honorable thing. Can I ask her about bad people? Are you bad people? You know what? I'm just going to fucking stick you. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. We're cleaning house. For the might of the Imperial Legion. Alright, so it did not update journal at all. Do I need anything? I'm not taking his hammers. Okay, so our crime was reported. That's fine. Doors of the Spirits, Prayer, Guide to Sadra of Mora, Guide to Alamora. I'm gonna take that. We might break into their house later. I'm not taking that because it doesn't do enough damage. It is pretty cool of an item though, but it's not gonna help us. There you go. Okay. Alright, so now we need to get back to Oh my goodness! We're a genius! Absolute genius! Mission complete. Hey guys! Let's see what you're made of. You've earned a death warrant for your crimes. Bye. Surrender now and I might let you Oh come on my guy, don't make me cut you down to size. Mistakes were made. Let's see what you're made of. Okay, I'm reloading. Okay, so we're gonna get a bounty as soon as we start slaughtering people. Um, actually, I got a potion of invisibility. So we're gonna teleport, drink the potion, and run in there and get paid. 
Uh, I don't know how we're going to get out of this afterwards. Wait, does she have anything I wanted? No, she don't. I do want that house key. Alright, so my crimes have been reported. We're gonna teleport back. Okay, okay, okay. And then we're gonna drink this. What say you? I see everything's been taken care of, and just in case you had any problems of legal nature, I spoke to some of my friends, and I've taken care of some things as well. And I did find that nice present from the Emperor here. It seems to be a ring, a very nice ring. There was no note with it, I'm afraid, but I'll let the Emperor know you've received it. I'm sure he'll be pleased. Ring of surroundings. Okay, okay. So he said he fixed some stuff. Does that mean he fixed our burglary and assassination? Ooh, that's cool. Expensive, too. I like it. I like it. All right, let's see if we can get arrested. Uh, okay. He has nothing. What say you? They have nothing for us. Excellent. They don't... They're none the wiser. Okay, so now that we've completed it, Old boys quest. Yeah, it's gone. Alright. What else we got on here? We have done a lot of quests. Sleepers Awaken. Okay, he may know some Alright. So this is about kind of the mess of dreams. I'm assuming to solve this one, we're going to have to kill Dagoth Ur. So we will save that for later. Pilgrimages of the Seven Graces. I have read the Pilgrim, Pilgrim's Path and marked the locations of the Shrine of Night. Gavis Dren. Give me a copy of the Pilgrim's Path and ask me to the Pilgrim of the Seven Graces. It describes where the Pilgrim sites are. After you completed these pilgrims, speak with me again. I should warn you that while most of these are easy, the pilgrimage of the ghost gate and the ruddy man are more difficult. Oh, we need to go back and talk to him. Okay, yeah, so he is in um, Mournhold. Says the Black Dark Gang. These are sewers. Made a request. If I see the ghost of the low. Alright, we gotta go back and talk to her. Citadel's at the sixth house. In Citadel or Dorsal, I discovered at the artifact blade Keening, one of the enchanted tools created by the Dwemer, Craft Lord Kagernak. Kagernak. Okay. So that's probably more of the uh, Dagoth Ur stuff. The Cursed Captain. The only other survivor of the shipwreck, a warlock and a seer. Western Coast is I met a name Grayway. Okay, this is about the dude that sunk the ship. We need to find his friend, I think. What else we got on here? The Lady's Ring. This one was glitched out because she set us up. Thirst Hunters. Stinja Snow Song has sent out hunters to kill snow bears and snow wolves and return with their pelts. Okay, so that is the quest that I sent them on. Alright, so we're pretty much all caught up on, like, a lot of crap. Uh, the Lady's Ring. Uh, that's Fargoth stuff, that's not it. Okay, so the Lady's Ring was up around here somewhere. Probably, like, right here. No, actually, it might have been right here, because there's a Dwemer Ruin here. So probably right here. But yeah, she set us up and I don't know if we put the ring back on her body or how the hell it is. And I don't even have the ring anymore. I don't know. 
I don't know. And I know there's more uh, missions than what uh, we have in our journal. Uh, mainly because I googled some of them. Um, pretty much Solstheim has roughly around 8 quests left for us. Mornhold has roughly 8 quests and we got roughly around 25 for Vardenfell left. Um, I don't know how we're going to do that one about the rain or we kill her. I think I'm going to go ahead and travel up that way. Yeah, we're going to take a Stilt Strider. We're going to head up that way. And I'm going to see if I can find that location again real quick that uh, had her body. And I don't know if I put the ring on her body or what happened. As far as I know, there's no way to resurrect somebody. But, but she set us up. She sent us over the hill to dig a ring out of a ditch. And then some half-invisible dude showed up. And decided, oh, I'm gonna attack you guys. I think it was cool. We make a special trip just for you. Yeah, that's same low close. price. Yeah, it's actually, really close to where we need to be. Huzzah! And we can leap so far. I love it. Oh, and other good news it has officially been two weeks without smoking a cigarette. Da 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 da. I'm well on the way to quitting. Well on the way to quitting. So happy about it. Kind of sucks too because I literally have smoked more of my life than I have not. I started smoking when I was about 13 and just recently stopped. All of about maybe 23 years of smoking. Better late than never, I guess. Okay, here's that one town, so she should have been out the road. Actually, I think it was right below that gigantic bridge. The hell was that? Oh, that's him. Yeah, those guys are cool. They pat the ground with their tail. They make sure that the nice, soft soil is nicely packed. So the weary traveler doesn't sink up to his a-hole and walk in. Yeah, here it is. Okay, so there was a dude, like, hiding behind his tree, half invisible. And, like, she was hanging out here. And she said that it rolled down in here. And then they attacked us. And I don't know what happened to the rain. And like her body's gone. And I can't, I don't know the console command to spawn her back. Or even if we can do that or not. But that's fine. We'll figure something out. If we can't complete it, that's fine. I'm not gonna fret too much over it. You know, she did try to like stick it to us. So she got what she deserved. Wait, are you attacking me? My guy. Okay, he's not. Ah, there you are. And look at all this muck sponge. We could not find that for the life of us in the past videos. And I don't have a bow to deal with him. That's fine. Hey, ruins. Ah, we keep finding those little guys. They work so hard. Yeah, yeah, we'll get up here. Alright, so I'm at a loss now. I don't know what to do, where to go. We pretty much need to just kill time. Uh, before we can continue doing them other quests on Solstein. And I don't think we've really been over in here that much. Aha! Oh, it's just an egg mine. It's just an egg mine. Keep our weapon sheathed. He's gonna bite me. 
Something terrible. That sounded so cool, like both of them dying at once. Queen's just chilling. See, that's why I don't really like going in egg mines. I don't ever have anything. Wouldn't really expect them to have anything. Except eggs. But... Yeah, this place was a bust. Just for good measure. I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to do a little more uh, research on as to where uh, quest givers are. But we'll get to it. We will get to it. Oh. Oh. Could this be something? Kenneth. Kenneth Ancestral Tomb. Was this the one that had the big funeral? Yes. Yes, this big funeral going on in here. I'm terribly sorry for coming back and interrupting when I said I wouldn't come back. But I forgot the location. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, I want that. So I'm going to wait a second. And I'm going to give it a good save. You know, I like auto saves and stuff, but I don't trust them. Hello? Okay. They don't want to hurt us. That's fine. Like... Here, gentlemen, this thing was in here. Deal with it properly. Oh my god, it's just sitting there showing teeth. They don't seem to be bothered by them. There's really nothing else in here. Yeah. Yeah, there's nothing in here for us. That's fine. Actually, I think this will be a nice little safe spot. We'll we'll say our piece for whoever it is that died here. We'll give them benefit of the doubt like they knew us. Actually, I don't know. I have no clue. But we'll pick this up in the next episode. But I hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching, and as always, stay awesome.